Hello, this is Onyx Tarot by Aubrey, and today I'm going to be doing a message for Scorpio. So thank you all so much for hitting the like button and subscribing. I really do appreciate it. Um, let's go ahead and go ahead and get a message for Scorpios. Message for Scorpios. All right, so we have, well, family wishes come true. Dragon, beware of self-delusion. And you also have Ant, work, achievement, and success. Bottom of the deck is June. Okay. So let's see what we have going on here. All right. So some kind of family wish um, comes true. Something that you've been hoping for, wishing for, trying to manifest. Ooh. Okay, we have the Five of Swords. So um, I feel like you may have been in a situation where somebody was looking out for their own best interests for some reason. Um, somebody in your family or somebody trying to affect, um, affect the family situation for you. Let's look more into that. So you have the Page of Pentacles, the Magician, Four of Cups, and the Lovers. Okay, so I feel like this person tried to offer something towards you or they're about to offer something to you. Um, this is somebody who did not want to work with you. They didn't want to collaborate with you. Um, this could be somebody that, again, somebody that has directly impacted or affected your family or your family, you know, dynamic. Um, somebody you have a child with, somebody that, you know, it could be anything. But it's somebody that you don't trust that has some type of offer towards you to work together. Somebody wants to work together now uh, with you and... I feel like you may have offered this person some type of like level of, um, hey, let's work together. Hey, let's end a conflict. And they refuse. But I feel like with the Four of Cups and the reverse coming out with the lovers, this is somebody who's clearly thought about uh, what kind of dynamic they want to have with you, especially in a family situation. So whether this is somebody that you were romantically tied to or um, a family member or family conflict, I definitely see um, that some type of family wish comes true for you. And I also feel like your stability will just be regained, especially if this is like somebody who financially impacted you and your family. Um, I feel like you're going to have some type of like clearance to just move forward uh, with your life with minimal conflict from this person. Yeah. Um, and I also feel like with the Seven of Wands clarifying the lovers, this is somebody who they're going to defend their partnership with you or defend the relationship they have with you, um, the co-parentship they have with you, business they have with you. They're going to defend it to other people um, in ways that they haven't before in the past. Okay. Okay, so we have beware of self-delusion. Uh, we have the high priestess. So, hmm, I feel like with this, you know all the things that you need to know about this person and also about um, this situation as well. Um, okay, wow. This person in a situation as well. Um, so trust your intuition. I don't know if this is like forgive but don't forget kind of situation. Let's see. Yeah, Knight of Cups reverse. Um, it may be important to continue to protect yourself, protect your energy um, with this person. Because, I mean, I don't know. I feel like the worst of, you know, trying to stay on top of what they're doing or what they're trying to plot and plan. I feel like that's over. But at the same time, I do feel like it may be really important to see this person for who they are with the sun clarifying the high priestess. And we also have the seven of swords. Yeah. So I feel like at any time this person can like try to revert back to who they are. But I do feel like for the time being, um, they are going to be on a different 
on a different like singing a different tune but again um it will be important to just don't try not to put anything past this person if that makes sense um like you know what do they say keep your friends close and your enemies closer that's like what this is okay um i don't know if i want to clarify that let's clarify seven of swords just to see what's going on queen of wands and the two of cups yeah so again just don't try not to be um green-eyed or what do they say wide-eyed and bushy-tailed i don't know with this person they will work with you you will see a better dynamic with them but at the same time again uh forgive but not forget keep your friends close and your enemies closer with this person um but again as far as a family dynamic or something that impacts your family um i definitely do see things will get better especially throughout this holiday season coming up all right next you have ant work achievement and success let's see what that's about king of swords okay let's talk about the king of swords queen of wands reverse five of wands okay so again you're going to see some type of better dynamic like balance with this person especially if you've had a lot of conflict with this person in the past you're going to be very successful and talking things out with this person and look what we have the temperance card so i feel like you have been healing and pouring into yourself and this person's been doing so as well um and they you both because you both are trying to move forward in your own ways i'm getting um you guys have a new opportunity to just really put the past behind you and to move forward i feel like you're going to see a side of this person where they're more in their authentic energy um they want things to work out they want to put you at ease they want you to know that they see you as a partner with the lovers. They want you to know that they value you, even though you guys may not agree on thing, but on things. But again, I do feel like you guys have a huge, um, you know, a really good new beginning here uh, with this person. Now, bottom of the deck is June, so we'll see what that is. But thank you guys so much for hitting the like button. I appreciate it so much. Uh, let's clarify June. This is June. All right, let's see. We have the nine of cups that fell on the ground. Ten of pentacles reverse. And the eight of cups. So I feel like the month of June is really important tied to this reading. Um, this could be something important could have happened in the month of June. I also feel like some type of ending could have happened, ending of a family situation tied to this reading. You could have walked away from somebody in the month of June. And also I feel like in the month of June, really of any year, um, you were in a place where you knew your worth and you knew that you could do better than this person and, and, then, and, and in this situation as well, okay? So I feel like some type of situation that either started in June, in the month of June, or however June resonates, someone, someone's birthday could have been in June. Um, but whatever this is, I feel like some type of major cycle is officially closing because this person is going to be fair and balanced and treat you the way that you need to be treated. But again, again, like this message is like, keep your friends close and your enemies closer. Um, they You're going to see this person be more fair and balanced to you um and more communicative but again try i would just i would just kind of keep your eyes open like sleep with one eye open kind of with this person but again overall i do see things you you basically in some type of cycle where this person wanted to control how something went with you and control the narrative when it comes to you as well so I do hope this was helpful. Um, thank you guys so much for hitting the like button and subscribing. I'm going to do an extended for this reading as well. I'm going to be looking at um, deep into this Ace of Pentacles, what kind of offer this person has for you. 
And um, I'm also going to look into the final outcome as well to see how this person will be long term. So feel free to check that out. You'll have access to all of the other extendeds. Um, you will also see the new moon and Scorpio reading and all of the exclusive readings that I post just on Patreon for you guys. So feel free to check that out. It'll be linked below. Um, and in the description box. But otherwise, thank you guys so much for hitting the like button, subscribing, and thank you all so much for watching.